Hey y'all, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can fix not launching or opening in farming simulator. And it's kind of annoying. It's actually super annoying when you just want to play the game, but it's not opening or uh, or it's not opening or it's not uh, launching. Okay, so I'm gonna share with you in this video what worked for me and what I've tested myself. Now there are other ways to fix this problem, at least to try to attend uh, fixing this problem. There's multiple ways and usually what I like to try to fix this problem is to, tr to use multitude of or a couple of methods to fix this problem because usually only one method I can't guarantee it will work. Probably it will work. I don't know. That's why I'm going to show you a couple of ways. So let's jump right into the video and make sure you subscribe for more tutorials. Thank you. And now what you have to do to fix opening usually this is related to Windows updates that a list for me what occurred uh, when I had this the uh, this up uh, this problem this launching problem this error this crashing usually it was related to updates so click on advanced options and here click on optional updates and here in optional updates make sure you check all the updates here and click on download and install okay that's what you have to do. Now this, this is the first method. The second method, you also you can also go to settings and here go to storage and here make sure you clear temporary files. Wait for the scanning process and click on remove and continue. Okay. Now the next method. Um, what you can do is to simply is to go here go check the description of this video and you'll be able to find all the links here and make sure you install microsoft visual c plus plus click on this link and install uh, install this okay click on save and just open this and then go to direct X and user make sure you don't want this as well so install both of this and this is what worked for me pretty much now you can also also obviously install Intel drivers this will this will install the latest drivers also for AMD users install this this is going to install the latest drivers and also for GeForce Experience users, for NVIDIA users, make sure you install this as well because it will automatically install the latest updates for you. So as I said, I don't have any problems when I'm playing this game, it works just fine, but make sure you install all the updates here. If you, have, if you head over to GeForce Experience, this you'll be able to see drivers and here in drivers, make sure you install make sure you install from here as you can see click on check for updates and then make sure you install available click on download make sure you install the latest updates that's available here in geforce experience okay so that's what worked for me and and i hope it's gonna work out for you as well it's just annoying when you have this uh, problem so i hope you have now uh, now you can play the game please leave your results in the comment section and your feedback and if i read there's a lot of people saying uh, didn't work. I'm gonna create a part two. I'm gonna look for other ways to help you fix this problem. So thank you guys for watching and make sure you subscribe for more tutorials.